Here's the part that almost no one's talking about. GLP-1s are actually shaping up to be one of the most interesting longevity drugs in modern medicine. Not because of the scale or because of the weight changes, but because of what they're doing to long-term metabolic health. Let's first talk about cardiovascular disease. Now, this is still the number one killer of men and women, and GLP-1s consistently show reduction in major cardiovascular events like heart attack and stroke, cardiovascular-related deaths. This is across multiple trials, large-scale trials. And these are not tiny changes. We're actually talking about double-digit improvements in metabolic and cardiovascular outcomes. And then next, we have cancer risk. I know this surprises people, but there are several large observational studies that have reported meaningful reductions in multiple cancers in GP1 users. In pancreatic cancer, colorectal cancer, endometrial, liver, breast, and we have over 50 clinical trials that show no evidence of increased cancer growth or cancer promotion in GLP-1s. So these are wild stats, I know. And then here's another one. So some of the biggest data sets, we actually are seeing 10 to 14% reduction in all-cause mortality. That's your risk of dying from any reason. And people on GLP-1s for metabolic health are seeing these benefits. So if we had a supplement that did that, everybody would be on it. It would be a, a miracle. And But it's because this is a medication, it can be a little scary, and we're kind of getting caught up in some of these rumors online. Yes, be careful. Use, work with a provider. Yes, of course, be responsible. We don't want to push extremes. You work with a knowledgeable provider. But from a longevity perspective, GLP-1s are easily one of the most fascinating underrated tools in metabolic health right now. And that's why I just did a, a full-length YouTube video on this t same topic.